Hello and welcome to Differential Discussions. I'm Melissa. And I'm Dave. And today we're going to be looking at Dole Bodies. I love Dole Bodies. Me too. They're pretty. So we had a video on toxic granulation. And we couldn't find any Dole Bodies on that toxic granulation slide. Um, but I found this slide that does have Dole Bodies. So here we are. Supplemental. Yeah. So... <laughs> A lot of times you find them together, but not always. So the trifecta would be finding dolly bodies, toxic granulation, and vacuoles. Yep. You always find them together? No. So this one, actually, there's vacuoles and dolly bodies here. <laughs> yep, yep. <clears throat> yeah, and so dolly bodies generally kind of come along with uh, um, like a stress reaction, releasing neutrophils uh, early into the circulation um so you'll see it in like sepsis and things like that you know but uh yeah so we have two neutrophils here uh one has a more prominent delay body i would say um yeah exactly right there thank you melissa um so a little bit more prominent blue the shapes can be irregular they can be kind of all different shapes so don't be looking for shapes so much as the the um it's kind of a pale uh pale blue um, and then in the cell to the right, there looks to be a smaller one. Yep. On the lower side there. Perfect. And then very faintly, um, and this is very, would be very easy to miss. I wouldn't fall to honestly, if you did, but it appears to be one, uh, in the top left there too. Yeah. Thank you, Melissa. Um, yeah. So they're in the cytoplasm of neutrophils, um, Generally, neutrophils, although you can find them in bands, metas, things like that, but usually neutrophils, and they're sometimes along the edge of the the neutrophil, like the edge of the cytoplasm, but sometimes you find it throughout the cytoplasm, so don't just, you know, have to find it at the edge. It could be wherever, and, you know, sometimes they're nice, round, easy to pick out dolly bodies, and sometimes they're more like a smudge in, in the cytoplasm almost. Mm -hmm. And it's just a remnant of uh, basically cellular processes, right? Because when your, your neutrophil is trying to be pushed out quickly, sometimes it doesn't get to dispose of or process a piece as efficiently as it, it could because it's trying to push that cell out of the marrow really quickly. Mm -hmm. That's where we get our dolly bodies from. Yep. So let's look around, find some more. Sure. Person looks a little anemic too. Just saying. There's one. So yeah, right at the edge of the, yep, perfect. Yep. It's a pretty good one. If I could focus it. <laughs> I can see it pretty decent, yeah. So yeah, right at the edge of the uh, the nucleus there where it's pinching together is a nice one. Mm -hmm. Let's see if we can find another one. Notice how we just went into like a super thick area too. Mm -hmm. We mm -hmm. went from a good area to a really thick area. That just happens sometimes the way the slides are made. It sure does. See, now we're back to a good area. <laughs> yep. On the right hand side. Yep. yep. Looks like there's one, two, three. Yep. Nice. Agreed. And there may even be one on the inside of the very, very faint down near the. Are you looking like right here? Yeah. That's a, a I don't know for sure, but just. Uh, Maybe, but obviously one's on the right-hand side. Uh, yeah, that middle one's hard to see from here, but those three, definitely. Mm -hmm. Cool. All right. Well, I think that's all we have to talk about with Dolly Bodies, so thanks for watching. Yeah, thanks for your time. Appreciate it. Please like, subscribe, and hit the bell if you'd like notifications whenever we post a new video. And feel free to reach out to us on social media or via email with comments or suggestions about future content. Thanks.